Guys, it is so quiet out here. I can't hear a, a car, nothing. Wow, man. This is where I am. I don't hear a thing. <laughs> Freaking, oh my God, man. What a, I'm on a wild goose chase. Is it windy? Yeah, the iPhone probably picks it up. It's really not that windy. Probably five to 10 miles per hour. <laughs> Out here in the middle of a freaking farm. They haven't even planted the crops yet. All right, that's like the second car I've seen. All right, there's the site. Uh, this is Verizon. And I think Verizon is back there. I don't know if you guys can see the smaller cell site. Oh my God. Okay. As we'll see the, well, that's Verizon underneath actually. All right, so that's Verizon guys. I thought it was T-Mobile there for a second. It's Verizon for sure. Thought it was Verizon. Yeah, it's Verizon on the bottom. Oh, uh, it looks like C-band only though. I don't see a CBRS antenna up there. So that must be T-Mobile back there, that smaller. I don't even know if it's smaller. Wow, let me see what I could do for you guys here. See if I can get you guys the visual there. Yep, there it is, Verizon at the bottom, AT&T at the top. That's new Ericsson gear, never before seen in Ohio. Ericsson for the mid-band, for the DoD and C-band. Notice it's still using the two antenna radio setup, not a converged or a whatever combo. Okay. How old is this AT&T tower? I'm not sure. Uh, it's probably, let's see if it's an American tower. There's the Volvizi over there. <laughs> let's take a look here. No sidewalks out here, guys. <laughs> All right, so we are at a Tillman infrastructure site. All right, I've heard of Tillman. No trespassing. Okay, well, we'll just, we'll go right here. FCC tower registration number is there. Site name is called North Fairfield. Okay. Competent climbers only. <laughs> okay, all right. So we do have confirmation of who's on here. And you can see the power. Uh, that's for the power. Let's see if I could zoom in for you guys here. Zoom in, AT&T says B, and then Verizon for C. Uh, no shelter. No shelter here. Uh, but you will see the backup generator. And sorry guys, I'm trying to get around the fencing. All right, so you see the, the generator is there. Looks like Verizon's generator. All right, so there's the AT&T generator to the right, the Kohler. There's Verizon stuff. You guys will see the Verizon sign right above it. Uh, 300 foot top. Man, this thing's freaking tall, man. Yeah. Look at that thing. Yeah, there's a look for you guys. Sorry, it's just, the YouTube app is not ideal. I'm going to record some videos once I'm done with this live stream, I think. All right, so... Uh, you said Everstream is back, Hall. Oh, cool. Yeah, it's a big one. I do see the fiber, fiber plumbing and stuff. You should know Everstream. <laughs> I do know Everstream. <laughs> they're uh, they're a Cleveland area provider too. Oh, it's all weeds. All right, so I think all that's really left for us to do now 
is to just test this thing from some distance. We'll test the sectors. Let's see here. Look at that bad flash. 600s. Probably on a one gig circuit, right? Forever stream. Ooh, doo -doo -doo -doo. Kidnapped. God damn, bro. <laughs> nice uplink. 637 down, 87 up. See the 5G plus icon up there? 